got him out of the bed, went back to Eli, he said, did you call for me? He said, no, I didn't call for you, go back to me. And it was an ongoing process of several trips, and finally, finally, Eli realized, boy, the voice of God is talking to you. And he said, the next time that he talks to you, and you hear his voice, you say, speak, Lord, for your servant here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Sitting around a fire, they begin to talk, and all of us, they got fish, probably 
fried them over on the on that fire. Jesus begins to break the bread. And as he breaks the bread, he blesses it. All of a sudden, the man they've been talking to all day vanishes. And he's over in his man. They look at each other and they say, Wait a minute. That was him. That was him the whole time. And I believe they looked at each other and said, I should have known it was him the whole time that he was with us. Did your heart not burn within you? I heard it speak to me as clear as a And it shook me. It shook me as I stood there. Nobody around in that locker room but me and reflection in that mirror. I heard him say, what you thought you got that fire, you didn't get it. And then all of a sudden, it was something moved on the inside. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I said, you know what, Bill? I said, at 3 that bill's going to ring, and I'm going to go get in that, I'm going to go get in that Ford Ranger pickup, and I'm going to drive back to my house, and when I get there, I'm going to take you back to the place that 